Oh, it's really good. It's really good uh, finally getting a new offense and really getting an opportunity to learn coaching Nas plays and him just liking players and fitting to his skill set. It's really not good. It's exciting. I think when you think back, okay, Hopewell, Tim Beck's offense, Coach Nye's offense, you know, do you kind of see some similarities or are there things that you pick up easily or things that are like, okay, this is going to take a while? Um, a lot of this stuff I've actually picked up pretty easily. Some things have taken a little bit longer than others, but, you know, if you want to go back to Hopewell and go back to, I mean, it, it's, it kind of reminds me of high school a little bit because a lot of things in high school was fit to my specific skill set and it reminds me of a lot of that. Like, it reminds me a lot of that just with Coach Anah because he's a real big uh, skill set type of guy. And what do you think is your skill set? <clears throat> um, I think I'm a... I'm a fast guy. I'm, I'm pretty big on my speed, uh, breaking tackles. Uh, I consider myself elusive, all those things. Did I, I don't know if you peruse the magazines at, at you know Barnes & Noble or the grocery store, but was it cool seeing you get some all-ACC recognition for kick returning, or yeah. did, did that get back to you? Yeah, yeah, it got back to me. It, it was pretty exciting. It, it was, it was uh, of course, good to hear, but my ceiling is so high for myself. That's, that's just one of many things I hope to accomplish. Yeah. Are, you, are you in contention for the punt returning duties too? Oh uh, yeah, yes, yeah, I am. I am. Uh, me and me and a few other guys are. You know, we're competing to uh, get the punt return spot. But you know, it's a it's a whole fall left, so we're going to see how that goes. What do you think you'll be able to show this year that maybe you weren't able to in the past or had the opportunity to show? Um, something that I feel like I'm going to be able to show is that I, I feel like I can do it all. I, I feel like I can play the inside. I feel like I can play the outside. I feel like I can even in the backfield if needed. I feel like just my my skill set in, in, like in, in entirety. Like I feel like I can do multiple things. Like not only that, but kick return as well, pump return. Like I can do so many things. When Brandon Armstrong arrived, whenever month that was, you're like, okay, I, I see what, you know, maybe you didn't know much about him at Virginia, but was there that moment where you're like, okay, I get it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was, it was several moments in the spring, not only like getting to know him and really knowing Brennan and who he is, but not only that, but the offense and how he understood the offense and just his maturity in the offense. It helped a lot. It helped me a lot. It helped so much. There's a lot of redshirt sophomores on the roster at receiver. <laughs> You know, what, what is it like being able to come in with a big group like that from a recruit, you know, as a recruiting class and then how you guys have kind of made the steps the last three years together? Oh, it was really good. It, it, was, it was really good. It was, you know, it's, college football is it's a competitive thing. So it was obviously we all compete for each other, but it's, it's healthy. We compete and not only compete, but we help each other. So that doing all that together is really good. It's been really good. Besides yourself, who do you see as a breakout guy, receiver? Um... Besides myself, I, I see Keon for sure. Keon absolutely. And uh, Anthony Smith. Yeah, I hope Anthony Smith for sure. Thank you.